Come on in. Good morning and welcome to Trans West Truck Trailer RV. My name is Katie O'Neill and I am so excited to be here with you today. We're coming to you live from, no kidding, Colorado Springs. We are at the 2023 dealer meeting. You are sitting inside of, with me right now, a 2024 Superstar with the new M2106 chassis. I can't wait to show you through this coach. And on that note, this is one of the most undersold and most spectacular floor plans that we offer in the Superstar. I don't know why we don't sell more of these coaches. I really want you to pay attention today to all of the capacity that you can have in this coach in a 37 foot coach. So this coach is 37 feet, 10 inches long. And I'll tell you, we sell a ton of the 36 VSB by Verona. There's no reason that you should not be looking at this 37 coach, uh, 37 foot coach by Numar. This Superstar is a wonderful offering, uh, but first and foremost, let's get started uh, from my favorite place, the inside out, but today we're gonna start at the dash. So go ahead, Avin, if you wouldn't mind, walk through that big black rainbow that makes all of the difference in the Superstar. This is what gives us that floating cab our independent front suspension, we're the only manufacturer to carry that. And this is the new M2106 dash. That's the most exciting thing you're going to see. That are, there's steering wheel controls on that steering wheel for volume, answering and hanging up your phone. We've gone to the stock control system uh, like you'll see in the Dutch Star or in the Ventana uh, for your transmission. So you still have that great Allison transmission, but that stock control is fantastic. It's also where you're gonna have your engine brake, all of your nice push buttons. As you can still see, there's still white stickers on, the, uh, on them. They are working on the remainder of the labeling for this dash, but all of the electronics are in. The dash has been rewired. We've got a much nicer interface for our uh, navigation and camera screen as well. Uh, this coach does boast the 360 surround camera. Uh, and then I love the way they've made this whole dash dark. It matches so well for us, the whole entire uh, front cab. And then of course we've got our beautiful panoramic window where you can see out and above. The skylight is uh, second to none. It is by far the largest in the industry and beautiful going down the road. Uh, there's a ton of storage up here, but look at your big JBL speaker up here. So giving you all of that extra sound that you're looking for going down the road. Just a great improvement this year. Um, I have a 2022 uh, Numar Superstar, and I will tell you, these cubbies are fantastic. When we get to our campsite, all the kids get a cubby, and that's where their stuff is. And if I find it somewhere else in the coach, that's where I put it. Oh, look at that, there's our friend. Hey, Darian, Darian Todd is our Numar rep uh, that will take care of you if you buy a Superstar. She's always available at the touch of a button or send of an email. Uh, but again, tons of over cab storage here. Um, I love this new, uh, this new cab. One of the nice features of this cab too is that you'll see we don't have a step into the cab. The step doesn't come until you get here to the front. We still have our air ride seats with all of our nice uh, our air adjustable uh, lumbar support and then armrests again on both sides. So again, this is the 2024 Numar Superstar. And this is the brand new M2106 chassis uh, interior. So this is what you'll be seeing in the future. Let's see if they did it, folks. Nope, still no mirror for lip gloss. One of these days, the Freightliner is gonna hear me and they're gonna put those in there for me, the driver of my 2000, our 2022 Superstar. I mean, seriously, guys, women need lip gloss application mirrors. I mean, that's just what happens. And we drive Super Cs, because I'll tell you one thing. This coach is easy to drive. Now, as I mentioned, this is a really uh, fantastic layout. I love having your dinette. This is a booth dinette. This is convertible, so this turns into another sleeping accommodation across from your theater seats. Um, you've got your great over cab storage here, or over booth storage. So tons of room up here. This is the curtain for the front, so you can keep all that light out of the cab. I do recommend getting uh, Freightliner actually carries a really nice Mylar backed um, insert that you can get for the windshield. That's a great purchase. That paired with this will give you the best insulation during that hot summer uh, sun. Um, but these fantastic theater seats are so nice. You've got so much storage here in the center underneath. 
Um, there's, I mean, if you take a look, you can keep all of your blankets that you would use and then have all of your remotes here on top. I mean, it's just a great amount of storage. But what's so nice about this coach is this feels so open and so roomy. And I love this toffee glazed maple high gloss finish. This has got so much panache. Um, these beautiful Lambrequins in this lovely light tweed with this silver banding throughout. The opening windows all the way around this area. You've got your 110 outlets and your USB ports right here, but they're also integrated here into the, uh, the controls for your theater seats as well. So plenty of power sources, overhead reading lights. I mean, this is just a beautiful, beautiful floor plan. And this is the 3731. This is a bath and a half model. So great dinette area here, lots of storage. As you can see, the televator is on the uh, right side of the coach, in my opinion. If I'm sitting down having breakfast, I wanna be able to look out the window. And it's so nice if I wanna watch a movie to be able to look towards the back of the coach. So party in the back, or party in the front, business in the back, this is a great window to have blocked. And then of course, when it's down, you have just a really, really lovely dinette setting. Uh, and you've got on top of that, a nice place to be able to keep your amenities. So you could keep your uh, salt and pepper shaker, you can keep your, uh, you know, uh, French press, your cream and sugar, all of those things here on this really nice sizable dinette. So if you're having dinner, you have all that extra room to be able to put some of the some of those uh, bottles of Perrier water, whatever it is that you might need. But again, this is such a great open floor plan. Now you have your sound bar above, extra storage on either side, so tons of cabinet space in this coach. Really deep and uh, nice compartmentalized cabinet space as well. You can get that PlayStation 5 set up. There's also room for a DVD player in here. I mean, you could have a Wii, you could have all sorts of stuff. That's a big, big garage. And then more cabinet space here. And then I love the 2024 uh, tile in this coach. Look at how this has got so much texture. It's really neat. It's actually reflective. It's beautiful and it's throughout the entire RV, anywhere we have tile. And again, this is the Croydon uh, graphics on the outside and the Brighton decor on the inside. So this, uh, this Brighton decor is really bright, especially when you tie it in with all of this new inlaid trim that you're finding throughout this coach for 2024. Now you've got your dual basin undermount sink. Um, this is a really nice stainless steel sink with a spray, spray and pour feature as well. Uh, so nice adjustable faucet, great storage up above. This is where I keep all of my uh, olive oil and vegetable oil and all my cooking stuff right here. You've got your wonderful Whirlpool convection and microwave oven. And then of course, one of my favorite features, no, not that opening kitchen window, which is optional uh, behind the kitchen, but also I love the fact that I have cutting boards on the outside of, or on the underside of my, of my stove covers. But I love the fact that I can take this true induction cooktop out and cook with it outside so I can bring one set of pots and pans. I don't have to worry about having, you know, one of those cast iron deals or anything along those lines. I can actually use my, my nice pots and pans throughout my coach, either, either inside or outside. So if I'm making something like fish, and I want to cook it outside of my coach, it's really easy. I can use all the same pots and pans because I can use the same stove top. Now you could have the optional micro or microwave. You could have the optional dishwasher here. Um, but when you don't have that dishwasher, if you are a person who likes to have lots of cooking supplies, that is a lot of room for pots and pans and dishes. Um, I think that that's really fantastic space. Certainly worth, worth noting uh, that you could have an optional dishwasher there. Um, I use my dishwasher more for a drying rack and storage than I actually use it while camping. Um, so that's a pro, right? You could use it as a drying rack. But the con is that I don't have nearly as much storage as, as you're provided here uh, in that nice separation of space. Now again, another four great individualized soft closed drawers. I love the fact that these are so compartmentalized so you can keep, you know, your cooking mitts and your dish towels, all of those things in separate places. And then I would be lost without a scrubby holder and my little trash can right there underneath. And then also I've got my uh, extendable island as well. 
and then I come back and here's my beautiful, I mean, you guys, you're really lacking nothing in this coach. You've got a full size residential Whirlpool refrigerator, 19.7 cubic feet. This is a fantastic refrigerator. I can speak from experience. It is so nice when we're camping, it carries so much. I have never completely filled the refrigerator or the freezer uh, to this day. And we bring popsicles and hamburger patties and all the stuff from Costco. So. Um, that speaks volumes. Nice water dispenser on the outside too, keeping you from having to bring that Brita because it is filtered as well. Uh, this coach also does boast a whole house water filter. Um, now you'll notice I'm standing on this tile. I love this tile floor for 2024. Um, this is a really, really nice coach. And honestly, we don't order a lot of this toffee, but this toffee is really just beautiful in this RV. I love this high gloss toffee. Now take a look at this really nice center bath. So much room in here for your guests. So comfortable. And then if you go down to the right hand side, I go ahead and show you, you have so much cabinet space here. Let me see if I can get in there. And then above here you have your beautiful vessel sink and then another really nice large medicine cabinet, an opening window, a fantastic fan above with rain sensing vent. And then new for 2023, we came out with this great new panel. This is so nice. So this can be paired to your phone. You can sync it to your Bluetooth and actually operate all the same things, whether it be your lights, you can, op you can turn on your HVAC system, adjust your temperature control, look at your tanks, your batteries, everything is all right here. And you can control all of these lights, all lights off, all lights on, TV lift up. It's so fantastic to have all of this here in the center of the coach as opposed to above the door. Really, really nice feature, but more importantly, to have it on your phone so you don't need to come up here to turn your lights off at night. You can do everything from a touch of a button. If you forgot to turn that one last light off and you could see it glowing from underneath you know, your pocket door, go ahead, just turn it off with your phone. You don't even have to get out of bed. It's just such a nice feature. Uh, now again, we'll talk about all the updates for the woodwork in this coach. They've added this beautiful chrome inlay throughout this coach, giving you just a little higher level of decadence. And I absolutely love this headboard. This headboard is so posh. I mean, I would consider something like this for myself. And I love the material. Once again, you've got this nice chrome inlay. You've got your overhead cabinets. You can run from your 110 outlet here in the center. Uh, something like a laptop or an iPad through the grommets on the outside. You've got your light control switch right here as well. If you've, you know, maybe your phone's dead. If that's the case though, you can plug it in right here at the nightstand. Then you've got plenty of room for your water bottles as well down below. And then I am going to lift up this bed just to show you under the bed storage. Oh, I can't wait to get to this bathroom. I'm so excited about this little RV. So I was talking to one of our Canadian dealers. Look at all that storage. I mean, this coach is laden with storage. In uh, the Renegade Verona, whether you're looking at like the LE, the LDG, the 38 LDG, or the 36 VSB, they keep the water tanks under the beds. So having all of this storage is really, really nice because um, it's something that you don't get in all of the super seas. And then another thing worth mentioning, and I'll show this to you, I'll leave it up the way it is. Um, so I love the way Numar gives you the ability to tuck your comforters in to the side of the bed. This is such a nice feature. It's something that you don't get on a lot of your super C's. You just, it's really hard to make the beds because you've got that tight, tight area on the left and right hand side of the bed. Uh, great wardrobe storage here as well. Really nice little LED lights here in the cabinets so you can see everything before you get ready in the morning if it's dark out. And then you've got your, uh, your HDMI plug for your 43 inch Samsung smart TV as well. So a 50 inch in the front, 43 in the bedroom. And then this has the optional 43 in the sidewall as well. Nice big drawers back here, full extension, a nice little dresser above your emergency exit window. And I love again, just this little chrome accent on the Lamborghini is just beautiful. Another wardrobe here. And for those of you that were afraid you were going to lose your safe, your safe is right here in the left wardrobe of the rear closet. So fantastic relocation of that product in a smaller footprint. Now, when I came into this bathroom, I was like, this is so incredibly cool. So I still have my washer and dryer. 
my Splendid stackable. I have a great drawer. I can actually sit down and get to my uh, Tide Pods and my little fabric softeners without having to crunch because I could just sit down on the porcelain throne. And then on top of it, I have this fantastic, oh shoot, that's a touchless Dometic uh, flusher. I've got this fantastic shower. This is such a big shower. Um, I've got my AquaView uh, water system. So this is going to, you know, this Aquamizer is going to keep my hot water uh, or keep my, uh, my cold water from going into my gray tank until it gets hot. Um, by just turning it from one side to the other, I can control that flow. Uh, that little light will turn red when the water is ready to go. Uh, all of that being said, you know, I've got 105 gallon water capacity in this. I've got a 60 gallon gray water tank and a 40 gallon black water tank. And look at how much storage is in here. I mean, this is amazing uh, for a coach of this size to have all of the capacity. Now, I'll tell you, you'll kind of laugh at me, but I would keep like my rice cooker, my coffee maker, my toaster oven back here uh, when I was in motion, because then when I went ahead and stepped out and went on my, uh, went on my, or got to my campground, I would be able to actually take those and put them out on the counter and get everything set up. But what a great place to stow some of those larger appliances and then all of the towels, everything that you could use here. And then look at this beautiful new sink for uh, the Ventana and the Superstar, which of course are sisters. Um, they have this fantastic new vessel sink in the master bathrooms. And oh my gosh, I did. I brought this from home. I didn't, I had not even, I didn't know this was coming, but I had to wear this outfit today because I had the matching bracelet. I think it's destiny, Andrew. I think you should give me a new superstar. What do you think? Come on folks, write in, comment down below on these live videos. Let everybody know that Katie O'Neill deserves a fantastic new superstar so she can tell you all about the new fantastic amenities. I mean, it's for work, right? Um, okay, so here's our great medicine cabinet in the rear again of this bath and a half coach. Such a small footprint, so much functionality. You've got a fantastic fan above giving you great ventilation. Uh, this is just a really, really nice RV. Now the one thing that's missing in this Super Sol Superstar is also missing in my 4065. There's, oh my gosh, Avin, this coach is better than mine. There is a robe hook. What? Turn around. It's up on the left. Oh, man. All of my wildest dreams in one coach. How do they do it? Uh, so again, I love the new ceiling treatments. I love this toffee high gloss finish. I, you know, I honestly, it's never been one of my favorites. It looks fantastic in this coach. This is a very, very beautiful RV. And then here's all of that extra pantry storage. So if you've got, you know, if you like to bake while you're on the road or you want to keep pasta, cereal, beef jerky, all of those things can be stored right here. Plenty of room for blood spray and, and suntan lotion. I mean, there's just so much storage in this coach. And then also, of course, we have our central vac system here. So we have our uh, kick plate as well as our attachment for our hoses. Uh, there's just a little bit of carpet throughout the coach. And again, this is an all electric coach with hydronic heat. So not only do you have the heat source of the heat pumps, but you also have a boiler system running uh, off of our dual loop Chinook system, giving you endless hot water and also great heat and cooler temperatures. Now this little bay above us used to be full of all sorts of stuff, but as you can see, there's a lot less buttons here to, uh, to, to talk about. So we've got our HWH hydraulic leveling system, which is also responsible for our fantastic steps the steps in the Superstar are second to none in the industry comparable to it. Uh, lock and unlock for all of your basement doors. This is an optional feature. I think it's really, in, really important. You also have a step cover here. So if you have a little, you can pull that step cover out and have you know, your you know, two-year-old granddaughter running around having the time of her life while you're out there camping without worrying about her falling down the stairs. This has the optional uh, dual uh, Gerard awning package. So these Nova awnings are just spectacular. They are a bifold, so they have a, an arm that tilts down, just giving all that much more shade protection. But what I find most frequently is I'm just using one or the other, depending on the angle of the sun, unless it's midday. And usually when it's midday, we're out, I don't know, hiking or fishing or swimming or something along those lines. But it's really nice to have the two different awnings because in the morning you might need one uh, drawn, in the afternoon it might be, need to be the other, but you don't always need to have both. 
Uh, so it's really a great system. And with the lights built into them, they make for a really nice family room on the outside. Now we are going to come by. I always like to mention I love this little uh, handrail going out into the, into the out outdoors. And uh, those are big steps. These are be, they'll be average size steps for someone like Avin. For someone like me, they're really big. <laughs> All right, so here we've got, of course, our nice closing screen door. And you can go ahead and close that. Keep the bugs out, keep the nice fresh air in. And then I love, so um, Joe and Terry, if you're watching this, I think Numar stole your red. I think that they actually incorporated it into one of their uh, main colors today or this year. This is again the Croydon graphics. This is a nice, if you're, at, if you're curious, it's a white with kind of a pewter color uh, and then a nice bright red and then a black. And this pewter color tends to look silver in some lights and uh, tends to look kind of a goldish color in other. Uh, I guess you could call it a Prosecco, so it's not quite gold, uh, but beautiful coloring. Um, I love this little exterior mirror when you're turning a corner and you need to see that curb that shows down from your driver's position. And then of course we've got our beautiful chrome convex mirrors as well. Big steps. And then yesterday I was trying to open the door to the Superstar. I did a video on the 4059 and it was locked, but look at how easy it is to get into this cab. So you have all of these handles. So when you wanna get up, it's really easy to get into this coach. So for those of us who have any kind of mobility issues, this is a really uh, important focus. Uh, driving a Super C, you're driving an M2106 chassis, which is a mid-size uh, semi-truck. And you all know we see tons of trucks going up and down the roads because they're easy to drive, they're solid on the road. Uh, they have a lot of safety while having that engine compartment in the front. So what's so nice about this is you've got such good ease of access because of the, the, the design by Freightliner. They spend so much time really making sure that this is a coach that not only people who are able-bodied and young that are out there camping get in and out of, but you know, you've got these truck drivers that make a livelihood, you know, having to get in and out of coaches day after day, putting hours and hours on the road driving. At the end of a long day, you wanna be able to get in and out of your coach safely and comfortably. And so you get that benefit when you go into a Numar Superstar just by default because you're picking up this fantastic chassis. Um, now we all know uh, everyone who talks about getting a superstar, there's so many different reasons. Drivability, engine access, all of these different things. So this engine compartment is really easily accessed and it's also very light. It's easy to get in and out of. You've got your windshield washer, you've got your jump points. Everything is super simple, but you also have these really um, awesome three piece chrome breakaway bumpers. So if you have a little fender bender, your insurance company is gonna save a lot of money by being able to replace this one panel as opposed to the entire bumper. You're also gonna have a lot less impact on the inside of the cab. So again, safety uh, is one of the best reasons to consider looking at a superstar. As you'll note here, we have our Wabco uh, lane tracking and we also have our cameras integrated up here into the dash. This is all new for 2024. This is what we have not had uh, in our uh, in our previous superstars on our M2106s, we always had to aftermarket everything. In the new M2106 chassis, all of your lane tracking and safety features are built into this coach. This coach also has the optional 360 camera. That's the overhead camera for the front. And then there's that big, again, sky window, just a beautiful, beautiful feature there. New headlights giving us better illumination. And then on top of it, you also have your left hand and right hand cameras showing you when you're passing somebody, whether or not you're in the clear. Um, I love the fact that they took um, so much care in how to create the most amount of storage capacity. Now, one of the things that happens is when we build these on the Star Foundation, we have a lot better cabinet storage, but we also have the ability to have a separate uh, pump that gives us air ride in our front cab. So, Almost every RV in the industry uh, has this uh, great M2106 chassis that's built on uh, the Super Cs. Um, but the Super C manufactured by Numar is the only one that has an air ride cab. So not only are you getting that great 
uh, drive down the road, but you're also getting a portion where the house, if it is, if it's hitting a pothole, it's rocking and rolling, the front is detached. That's why you've got that big black rainbow inside. And this air ride cab is aired up on its own. And so it's kind of like when you have your head on your neck, it gives the coach the ability to swivel. So you can actually have a nice supple ride sitting in the front of this big beastie machine. And it certainly is one of the reasons that people consider a superstar. And look at the amount of storage in this, comp this compartment. Now I know you're all thinking, oh, well, that's so sad. That means I can't have the little refrigerator. Well, no, 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 that is not the case. You can have all of this storage. There is so much storage in here. It is so impressive. And you can still have your mini fridge. Look at that. So you've got this smaller Dometic, but I'll tell you, this Dometic has plenty of room. It's got two compartments. You can make, you can keep popsicles and beer in there. Whatever you want, it is all available to you. Um, I love this is a great place for this television. As you can see, it's shaded by the cover. So if you're watching the game outside or tailgating, uh, just speaking from experience, you've got your awnings out, you've got your TV uh, screen out, you're watching, uh, maybe you're, uh, we went to the Red Hot Chili Peppers concert, brought our, our television, had the videos rocking. Everyone's sitting in their lawn chairs. This is just the right height. Uh, so really nice Samsung 4K smart TV once again. Uh, the docking lights are optional. There's an extra lighting package I would certainly recommend. Anytime you get to camp late at night, it's nice to have extra lighting. But look at all of this storage. So because of our uh, raised uh, floor, because of our, our superstar uh, star foundation, we have uh, a raised chassis rail where we have this extra nine inches of space back here. And also tied in with that, you have pass through. So, so many uh, super C's do not have pass through compartments. This is a full pass through compartment. There's so much room in this coach. Uh, that's a little extra porcelain tile, and tile floor on the right there. Those are your two uh, manual awning controls if you forget your remote on the inside. And then you had your inner vac system for your vacuum cleaner as well. And uh, this is another great little compartment, but it also houses the release for this fantastic uh, garage. So this garage is wonderful in so many different regards. First of all, it's got a built-in rain shelter. So if you do have something where you need to come back and get maybe your extension cord out, whatever it might be, you're still covered in case it might be a little bit drizzly, but all of this storage is so long. You could fit brooms back here, you could put mops, you could fit paddleboard paddles, um, hockey sticks, whatever sport it is that you might partake of, all of those things can fit right here underneath this bay. This is so much capacity. And then these shelves are so deep and so, uh, so uh, um, heavy duty. You can really keep a lot of stuff in here. I know Jason um, has ours loaded up with like extension cords and I, I don't know, dude stuff. I, I mean, I, I was thinking, you know, top shelf mixers, blender, but you know, it's a dude's thing. So. No bar for me. Oh man, look at that back end. She is gorgeous. Uh, here's the camera for your 360. There's your rear view backup camera. Big illumination, big back end. A lovely, lovely uh, designs for 2024. I love the graphics they came out with this year. A 360 horsepower on the new M2106 chassis. This is 1,150 foot-pounds of torque. It's a 20,000 pound towing capacity. It's already pre-wired for your, uh, for your um, it's got your seven pin connector. You will need to add an integrated brake controller uh, if you'd like to uh, do that. Or you can also uh, add that. Uh, we use a lot of times the Blue Ox tow bar system. But if you are towing anything in this coach, I have to tell you, this is a really, really nice machine that's gonna do its job in getting you up and down those hills comfortably and having enough power to feel comfortable getting up the road. So I'm gonna show you how they've done this. So it's kind of interesting. You've got access to this bay here. This is a great place for lawn chairs on the right-hand side. And I thought it was really fascinating. They've moved the Chinook dual loop system to the back of this coach. And what's nice about this is this is not, you don't have the generator underneath your bedroom floor. You actually have it more towards the front and mid of the coach. So this is your dual loop Chinook system. This is of course what's giving you uh, tankless hot water, hydronic heat. This is a fantastic uh, system. The dual loop just gives you more control over zones. Of course, your big, beautiful Alcoa wheels, a nice little place next to your docking light to keep your gravity hose as well. 
Uh, you cannot have SantaCon on a Superstar. If you would like to have a SantaCon system, right over there, go ahead, pan, Avin. Get to that Supreme Air. That's where you get your SantaCon system. So I think it's just so fun to see all of the fantastic RVs that are here in this lovely facility down at the Broadmoor. Um, God, what a treat to be here today. Uh, so there's your whole house water filter, your fantastic uh, water bay, of course. Everything is easy to access, very well labeled. And as you can see, they've got your uh, black water and uh, your gravity hose outside of that bay, which is really nice. It actually has a separate compartment uh, built into it. Uh, and there's a little, uh, little cover there because you can spray that out and there's a drain so you can clean it. And that water reel is on a power reel as well. So the water hose, um, you know, takes up so much less room when you can actually put it on a reel. So again, they put your hydraulic leveling pump right here in the center. This is, this is the HWH uh, hydraulic leveling system. Again, that's going to be used for your levels and for your step. And then for the Supreme Air, it's actually used for your slide. The HWH uh, uh, hydraulic systems are what's given us the ability to do more floor. Um, so just a really great partnership with Numar. 50 foot power cord on a power reel. You've also got your surge protector and your inverter in this center compartment. And look at this, this is so cool. I, I, you know, I was walking this coach earlier today and honestly, I don't think I've seen a 37 foot 2023 even. Um, but look, at there's your eight kilowatt quiet diesel generator by Onan up here in the front away from the bedroom. Really, really good uh, change of location for those of you that are desert camping and running your air conditioner at night that need to run your, uh, need to run your generator. So we love that. In 2023, they made these doors easier to close. They weren't kidding. They are so much easier to close. This is a great compartment here. Eight lead acid batteries, giving you 800 amp hours of storage. Uh, if you would like to have the lithium ion battery pack that is available this year in the Supreme Air. Uh, but for this, I mean, I'm running this uh, same exact battery system. I have the eight uh, LED or lead acid batteries. Um, and I honestly, I had three of them in my Verona. So I've never had a problem. If they go low, my gen turns on automatically. But if you want to upgrade again, there's a Supreme Air right behind Avon. We can always do that for you here at TransWest. Uh, another camera, again, just nice to see the ease of access into this compartment. I'm going to give Avon an opportunity just to kind of pan in and show you uh, the underbelly of that new M2106 dash. So we can see that kind of go through and show you what you're going to have and what to expect in this new chassis that's coming out. Now, please keep in mind, this will not make uh, its first introduction until a little late in the run. We will not be running a 2024 chassis uh, until run 10. So if you're into a superstar, keep, please keep in mind, we have plenty of inventory uh, available right now. We've got a lot of incoming units. They're gonna be built on that 2023 chassis. You'll have to wait just a little bit longer if you wanna hold out for this new 2024 product. Uh, again, this is a 2023, I'm sorry, 2024 Numar Superstar. This is one of my favorite floor plans. This is the 3731 in the Croydon graphics. Um, I have to keep looking at that word because it's not something familiar to me, but I think she's absolutely drop dead gorgeous. And I would love to see you out on the road camping. Please let me know how I can help. My contact information is below. Text me, call me, email me. It's the reason I make all of these videos. I am available. I would love to help you answer questions and work through the solution to get you and your family happiest out there on the road camping. Thank you so much for tuning in today. It's an honor to be able to shoot this video for you.